Hey guys, Husker Man here with another video, and this is the long-awaited G Fuel episode. And of course, I'm here with my good old friend, Pokemon Moron. Say hi. Hi! So, yes, we are going to start right into this. So, first I want to show you guys, this thing lights up, and I'm so proud of it. Wow! <laughs> and it has two other modes, so there's a nice flicker, and it's a slow flicker. It's crazy, I know. It's a little things. I can... There it goes. But, wow! So it's got this beautiful can of a uh, cherry lollipop. <laughs> cherry lollipop G Fuel. And then we've also got this nice little Pac-Man cup that opens. It's crazy. Nothing else special. Kid-friendly kid reactions only, kids. You can drink out of Pac-Man's mouth. Yeah. I can finally achieve my childhood dreams. <laughs> Pac-Man anyway. puts balls in his mouth. You don't want to. You don't want to drink <laughs> no, from his oh mouth. Oh my god. <laughs> I mean, he 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 puts melons in his mouth. <laughs> and cherries. <laughs> and oranges. <laughs> I hate you so much. He even puts keys in his mouth. <sighs> or at least that's what they look like. Is it keys? Are I think keys? so. I don't know. But I mean, I think he puts Miss Pac-Man in his mouth too. But you know, we don't talk no! about that. No. <laughs> Not that. Cool. Inspired by Pac-Man. Mm -hmm. Here's the side. So you got one side that's him gonna eat a power pellet or a ball. Power pellet or a ball. And on the other side is afterward. <laughs> we need to try this at some point. <laughs> I don't want to try balls. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Whoa! I've never been a fat ass, so I'd be I'd be a I'd be an amateur fat ass. I can teach you the ways. The ways of the force. It is done. Okay. Not sponsored by G Fuel. Yeah, I forgot to mention that before we started the video. G Fuel, if you want to sponsor me, though, you know... Nobody will sponsor you. No <laughs> That's some weird-ass tasting bullshit. Hmm. I don't know. It's not bad. Yeah. But it is definitely weird. It's weird. I don't hate it. Because... It kind of gives more... You can tell that it's like an artificial cherry. Yeah. But like, it's not super strong in cherry. Like, there's supposed to be something else there. Because there is something else there. I just don't know what it is. Yeah. It's probably that lollipop flavor, actually. Because it's... Yeah, you know what? Now that I think about it, it kind of does taste like a lollipop. Yeah. It's like, not... You can tell that... I think that little part is supposed to be like, Hey, we're sweet. I'll probably rate this a 6 out of 10. No, don't give it a 4 out of 10. Don't buy it again. But finish the rest of the tub, but just don't buy it again. Yeah. Like, it's not like, it's not terrible. It's not my favorite compared to the other ones that we've done. And I'm sure some of the other flavors um, of the ghosts are probably going to be better. Um, which I'm really interested in trying to see. I'm going to see if they have a um, sale going on. And then if they do, I'm buying them. So, yeah. well, actually, surprise, motherfucker! I got the pink one. <laughs> oh my god! Oh my gosh! I pulled it out of somewhere you don't want to mention. Pinky. <laughs> listen, listen to the flavor. Cotton candy, watermelon, and vanilla. <gasps> Three random flavors. If G Fuel has taught us anything, they can mix. Three random flavors and make it taste good. Some of these flavors are like a flavor roulette. <laughs> uh, that one! Okay, what else are we gonna have? Uh, that one! Uh, that one! Oh, that makes sense. Let's have some, like, oh, let's have some banana chocolate milk <laughs> strawberry! <laughs> Except it's colored like a blueberry. <clears throat> that is weird. Oh my god. Okay. <laughs> I opened this off camera. This had no scent. No, this one had no scent. It mostly smells like vanilla, is... though. Like, yeah, I'm, kind I'm, of. I'm mostly I mostly mean, getting. You know, you know your flavor is a lot better than I do. Ah. 
one spit at me. <laughs> Mine did too. Oh, I smell funny. That's not bad. Oh, that aftertaste. Oh, yeah. See, I thought it was pretty good. And then there's the aftertaste. The aftertaste is like vanilla cotton candy. <clears throat> yeah. There's barely any watermelon. Yeah. It's like, like a little bit right at the beginning. Yeah. Because the vanilla, I don't think is bad. I kind of like the vanilla. The watermelon, yes, I agree with you. I hit it in the beginning, but it just gets yeah, overwhelmed it's, by everything else. It's overwhelmed by the vanilla. Yeah, a 5.5 5 out of 10. Like, it, I, I like the cherry lollipop just a little more. They're both weird. I would give it a 3 out of 10. You gave the other one a four, didn't you? Mm hmm Okay. If you want to see more food review shit, let me know in the comments. Or, or his check comments. Out, yeah. Um, his YouTube channel. That's my food reviews. My YouTube channel is Pokemon Moron 2 currently. However, in the future, it might change to just the Moronic Company. Because I'm thinking about rebranding, except I don't know if it's quite a good idea yet.